You can buy a generator for your bicycle where you attach uh, a small, looks like a little motor, and then there's a little wheel that spins against the side of your, your tire and generate electricity to power your uh, light at night, your bike at night. And now, nowadays, they don't worry about these fancy ways of generating electricity, but in the old days, that's what we used to do. This is also a generator. I'm going to turn this crank and generate a current in this uh, bulb. Okay, so what's happening here? This is actually hard to turn, and the reason is that there are coils of wire in here and magnets, and there's a change in flux in the coils of wire that is produced by the turning motion of the coils. And through Faraday's law, the change in flux through a coil of wire generates a current in the wire. And that's the current you see in the bulb here. So a generator, there's one of these in your car, it's called an alternator because it has some extra gadgets, but at, at the very heart it's a generator. You've got the motion of your wheels of your car that generates a current that charges your battery.